beneath this canopy begins our story. But out of the jungle is the dawn of humanity. Ever since then, we had been famed as the one and only man, the toolmaker, until a woman redefined man forever. Her name is Jane Goodall. In the lush rainforest of Gombe, Jane saw a chimpanzee using tools for the very first time. Sixty years later, the burning question remains, what does it mean to be human? Ethology might have your answer. At the Ethology Lab of Osaka University, from experiments to bring out unseen capacities in animals, to vigorous field work at zoos and sanctuaries. We stay out in the wild studying animals just to capture the essence of their being. Ethologists spend hundreds of hours on observation and data analysis, all for the quest of the human nature. Thanks to ethology, we know that not only humans have compassion empathy, love, and care for one another. Ethology is blurring the line between humanity and the rest of the animal kingdom. And we know that not only humans are capable of cooperation because we found that Japanese monkeys at Awajishima have their own culture of altruism which is the making of sarumoji, unlike any other groups of their species. And even in the realm of intelligence, birds like crow are able to use tools to get their own food. Octopuses use coconut shells as their shelter. And chimpanzee Ajumu can memorize numbers in a blink of an eye. Mother Nature creates the animal world with such beauty and mystery. And even though we have been evolving on a separate path, but one thing is for sure, all life forms are connected. So what makes us uniquely human? Our journey starts here with ethology.